In this video, I'm going to show you an amazing plugin that allows you to adjust and add views in X-Men 11. This free plugin has helped me fix one of my planes and has helped me add custom views to some of my other planes. Hey guys, this is Dan from VR Flight World. If you're new to me and the channel, we talk about everything VR Flight, so make sure you hit the subscribe button and bell notification so you don't miss out. So the plugin I'm talking about is called VR Tools. Now this plugin has a few different features built in. The one I wanted to focus on is the view adjustment. Essentially with this plugin, you can add view hotspots to your plane. This allows you to adjust the position and height of all the current seating positions. It also allows for custom positions. For example, I created a custom position that allows me to get nice and close to my gauges. Just like if you were leaning in to get a good look. This lets you lean in nice and close without having to knock things over with your face. This works great if you're running a low resolution VR headset and trying to read the smallest gauge. You can easily switch to this view and then hit the default pilot view to bounce back to your, into your chair. When you set up a hotspot, you can go to the hotspot by using your transport function on your VR controller. On the Oculus Rift, this is a small thumbstick on your VR controller. This would really come in handy when flying a large airliner, where you want to view the flight from your passenger's point of view. My favorite feature of this program is that you can adjust the default cockpit views. This allows you to adjust the pilot position. You can essentially adjust the seating position to properly reflect your height and position. You can then hit the update and commit to confirm that selection. When you do, the seating position is now saved. When you use the default reset button for the pilot view, it automatically places you in the proper position. The Douglas C-47 is a freeware plane that I have recently downloaded. However, it has a problem with the seating position. When you use the default seating, it places you back so you are too far back in the chair. With this tool, I have been able to move my seating position forward and to the left. I also adjust the height to make sure it fit properly. When I did this, I now feel like I'm actually sitting in the Douglas C-47. This makes for a much better experience and I no longer have to worry about changing this every time I reset my view. The plugin is also easy to install. All you need to do is download the plugin from xplane.org. You have to make sure you're signed in to the forum to download this. Um, I highly recommend making an account because there are so many great freeware applications that you can get from xplane.org. And once you download it, you just unzip the file and place that in your xplane 11 plugins folder. Once it is in your plugins folder, it should be good to go. To open it up, go to x 11 VR, open up your menu and go to the advanced menu. Click on plugins and then go to VR tools. Here's where you'll find your hotspots. Click on the hotspot editor to begin adjusting your views. Now this plugin does a few other things as well, such as it allows you to view and edit a text document. My other favorite part of this plugin is the fact that you can place the FPS in your cockpit this is a small box that you can easily blend in with your cockpit, allowing you to see the FPS while taking a flight. To add this, go back to your VR advanced menu and find VR tools again. Instead of clicking hotspots, click on data display. You will then see that you can add the FPS as well as many other things. If you're interested in some free aircraft, take a look at my video on the right and lower left side of the screen. These are two great aircrafts that I really enjoy flying. So take care guys and I will see you in the next video.